With breaking news from Wallingford, that's where a serious rollover crash involving a van left a trail of destruction. And tonight we've learned one person is dead. Good evening and thanks for joining us. I'm Erin Connolly. Hi everybody, I'm Mark Zinni. This all happened hours ago on Church Street, right between Hanover and Chapel Streets. The Pinpoint News Tracker is showing you the location. Channel 3 Eyewitness News reporter Hector Molina is live in Wallingford tonight with the very latest. Hector. That's right, police just confirmed this crash was deadly for us just a few minutes ago, and that driver was driving this van you could see being towed right as we speak. That van had significant damage to it, and it was actually found laying right next, just inches away to this house you see right here. This all happened after it took a wild path after crashing into a telephone pole, and you could see some of the destruction it's caused with uh, several wires down on the street as well. Now, Wallingford Police says that this all happened around 6.30 this evening. The police haven't said if any anyone else was injured in the crash or what exactly caused the van to hit that pole in the first place but we spoke with someone who lives in the area who heard it all ap her who heard it all happen earlier this evening i heard a loud horn just laying on it and then what sounded like a almost like an earthquake i had no idea the power kind of went out a little bit and then next thing, my ring camera went off and it said that there was notifications that there was an accident. And we actually spoke with the wife of the man who died in that crash. She said he was 65 and she was just very shaken up. And after seeing what exactly happened in this crash. Now, we asked police if this crash caused any power outages. We did see what seemed to be like houses without power. We see them, a few of them have their lights back on at this time. But as for the investigation, police are still working to figure out what exactly caused that crash. As soon as we have that answer, we'll be sure to share it with you. We're live in Wallingford tonight. Hector Molina, Channel 3 Eyewitness News.